guys, it's Julia and welcome back to my channel. And for today's video, I'm going to be doing a tag video that I created this tag. And there's another tag similar to this called the Booktuber Shoutouts tag, so I'll be sure to have that link down below the original video. But I wanted to recommend some booktubers to you guys, but like I didn't want to forget anybody and I didn't want to like just name rant like just name people because I find that boring. So I came up with like 20 questions and you can answer this several times if you want to. Like you can do this tag several times so then like you can still recommend more people which is what I'm probably gonna do is I'll probably do this again in like a year or two to recommend more people to you guys. And you can answer multiple people for each question. But I just came up with this tag and I thought it would be really fun and I've been really wanting to talk about some of my favorite booktubers and also hear some booktubers that you guys recommend down below. So let's jump right into it. Number one is who's the first booktuber you watched? The first booktubers that I started watching was Heather from Bookables and then from her I found Kat and Jessie and Jessie's still one of my favorites. I still watch all three and I still love all three but Jessie is one of my favorites. The question is who's encouraged you to start your channel? It's all of Booksplosion. They are kind of like the top of booktube so everyone knows who they are but they did like show me everything. Not personally, but I just found everything through them, so yeah. And three is who continues to inspire you. For me, this is going to be Midnight Reads, who is so lovely and has, hasn't has been making videos for very long, but continues to just grow, and she's just very sweet, and her channel grow, has been growing a ton, so it's just really inspiring to see that. And also Books and Lala because of how much creativity she puts into her videos and how much creativity she puts into the editing of her videos. So both of them, I love them both. God bless. Four is have you met any booktubers in real life? And I've only met one, my friend Kayla from Literature Reads. Um, I love her, she's so sweet and she's definitely worth watching and she's definitely really underrated. So definitely check her out and I'll have all these people that I mentioned listed down below. Question number five is name some of your favorite male booktubers. So for this, I have Mike from Books and Looks. I have Jay from Captured in Words, Sajid from Books and My Social Life and Dylan from Dylan the Reader 5. They all have great content and Dudes on booktube aren't as recognized and there is majority of booktube is female so I do like seeing dudes on booktube and there's actually like a male booktuber book tag so that's really cool as well so I'm probably gonna like go through those videos and like see all the male booktubers and I think there's a playlist link somewhere I'll have that link down below that is full of male booktubers so if you guys are looking for them specifically I'll have all that down below. Number six is your fave booktubers of color. So for this, I have two. So I have Sajid from Books of My Social Life, who is one of my dear friends that I've had for several, is it years? Like a year at least. And I also have Olivia and she makes some really interesting content. She combines art and books together. She does a lot of defacing, um, a lot of really cool stuff. I specifically loved her The Savage Song defacing thing. It was really cool and she's definitely also worth checking out. Evan is a booktuber who reads a wide variety of genres and for this I have three options. So I have Chelsea Dolling Reads who I really enjoy watching and makes really great content as well. And I also have April from April with Maximus. We kind of have similar reading tastes in a way like um, contemporary and then mental health fiction wise. And she also reads like other things like historical romance and all that other in fantasy and just so much stuff. And then I also have Riley from Riley Marie who reads a lot of contemporary and a lot of high fantasy as well. So uh, good balance there. So yeah. Eight, which is personally one of my favorite questions. It's a booktuber who makes you laugh. So for this, I have several listed. So I have Jessie from Jessie the Reader who always makes me laugh. I have Sajid from Books of My Social Life who like I'm dying watching his videos. Um, I have Jay from the other Jay, so I have another Jay. Um, Jay from the Awkward Bookworm, who's just like really cute and adorable and like she makes a lot of jokes and she's very... Well, I also have Lily from Lily C. Reads, who is very popular and I found her through Booktubeson and she's, like, she's really funny and I really like her videos, so her. And then I have Michael from Michael Book Lion, who's hilarious as well. Um, Chami from Read Like Wildfire. P 
Piera from Piera Ford, I believe. I love her videos so much. And Whitney from Witty Novels. Like, I love all these people so much. Like, half of them don't know who I am, but it's fine. Um, I just wanted to, like, suggest some booktubers to you guys. So, like, all of these people are great. Nine is the Beloved Book Duo. So, for this, I have the Books and Looks, and I love them. <laughs> Like Mike and Becca are so great. They're married, but they're like so adorable and they're just great. I love their videos. I'll have them linked down below. Again, another underrated booktube channel and they're both great. And hashtag Mike for Red Rising. I hate myself. I also have Maddie and B from A Heart Full of Books. I love them. They're sisters. Um, they're great. I love their videos so much. So them. Question is, Next is a booktuber is that is a joy for you to watch, which obviously all of these people are, but I wanted to shout out some more. So I said Allie from Hardback Quarter, who I love watching her videos. Like that's like literally all I'm saying is I love this person's videos, but I love her personality. She has great hair. She's just badass in general. She's also great at editing. She made my intro, which I get compliments on all the time. I didn't make it, she did. Um also, I have Holly from Holly the Book Lover, who's, again, extremely underrated. She's really adorable, really sweet, reads a lot of great books, and talks, like, she's just very intelligent the way she talks about them. She also makes videos about her college, and um, actually her, she also makes a lot of videos about her university experiences, so if you're interested in that kind of content as well, she does provide that on her channel. Next, I have Ariel from Ariel Bassett, who is, again, very well known, but I love her content so much. I've been watching her for years. She's one of the booktubers that I have, like, on notifications, because I have very, like, I don't have everyone on notifications because like I don't um I love everyone <laughs> that I mentioned but I don't have everyone on notifications but she's one of the people that I do and that I just like w watch her videos like ASAP so I love her content and her personality and her taste in books so her <laughs> And then I also have Molly from Molly Reads. She makes great content as well. Some different videos provided on her channel along with books. Shout out sort of it's a book that is associated with a booktuber so that a booktuber that is obsessed with a certain book and that's what they're known for so like jesse with miss peregrines um i also want to mention dylan with we are the ants um sajid with the tale for the time being um a tale for the time being my bad uh, and homegoing and like probably me in the version suicide so yeah 12 is another one of my favorites and that is a channel who makes more than just book videos so for this i have lunar sky who her name is rebecca she's very sweet she makes book content as well as art videos which i love watching she has some great editing skills and she's of like a smaller channel so it's just like i want to see her grow so go check her out she's great i also have holly who again makes like university related videos as well which i find personally really interesting because you know school everyone does it Everyone has been through it. Everyone is going through it. So yeah. 13 is someone with who makes great discussions. So for this, I have Emma from Emma Books, who is one of my all-time favorites ever, who I've been watching for a long time as well. And I love the way she just formats her discussions. I love her videos. Um, she's another person who really inspires me in terms of my content. And she's just overall like a really great person. Like I don't know her personally, but she seems like a really great person. And from like, and she has really great makeup and she's just really cool. So I love her so much. And I also have, who makes really great discussions is Sajid. Again, I mentioned him already, but he really does make great discussions and also manages to make me laugh throughout them, but remains serious when he should be. Do you know what I'm saying? Then I also have Leanne from Scrap Paper Scribbler, who just doesn't make videos very often, but when she does, I really enjoy watching them and I find them really insightful. Number 14 is someone who you say their intro with them. So for this, I have Jesse the Reader, who I always say the intro with. Like, is that weird? Like, I just do that. So I'm always like, hey, what's up, Reader fan? <laughs> I get, and then Jay from The Awkward Bookworm, I do the whole, let us get started. <laughs> I'm sorry, I didn't do it justice, but. I, I always say that, which is weird, but whatever. Booktuber who I have notifications on for, and I have notifications on for Girl Reading, who I really love her content. She made the Rapid Fire book tag, which kind of blew up a little while ago, and she's just, she reads a lot of books, she discusses a lot of books, she seems like a very sweet person, and her set, her background and her setup is just so nice and simplistic, and I just really like it. 
Number 16, it's a booktuber who encouraged you to pick up a book and that you ended up loving. So for this, I have Rachel from Rachel Louis Adkin, one of my dear friends, and she, along with one of my other friends, encouraged me to pick up The Catcher in the Rye, which is one of her favorite books, and I absolutely loved it. I thought it was great, so yeah. And my friend Lena also talks about it all the time and she really liked it, so I'll have her blog link down below as well. Number 17 is just like a wild card, so just recommend a booktuber. And for this, I Sarah from Sarah with an H. I think she makes great content. I've been watching her since she started and it's really nice seeing her just grow and I just really enjoy her videos. And a shout out some lovely subscribers. So booktube is obviously involving the creator, but it also involves the viewers. Of course, YouTube is the creator with the viewers. So um, I want to just put some comments from specific people that comment all the time and that I appreciate their support so much. So thank you guys so much. There's so many of you. So I can't say some specifically, like I can't put everyone's up here, but these people comment all the time and are really supportive of me and my content. And just thank you so much. It means a ton. And yeah, I hopefully can do this tag again in the future and mention more of you guys because you guys are all great. Here I have shout out three channels under 1k subscribers. So for this I have Rachel from Rachel Louis Atkin. I have Holly. I have Holly from Holly the Book Lover and Kayla from Literature Reads who are three lovely ladies that I love so much and that are very great so definitely check them out. And the 20th thing is tag some people, spread the love. Who do you tag? So I'm going to be tagging everyone I mentioned in this video, which is a lot of people. So I'll have all of them listed and linked in the description box. So make sure you check them out. And if you do, tell them I sent you because that's really cool and it's kind of cute. So thank you guys so much for watching. I really don't mean to exclude anyone. Like I was really worried about making this video because I don't want like to exclude certain people, but I wanted to shout out some of my favorite booktubers and some of my dear friends or some people that I just think deserve more exposure here. And also for you guys who want to find more booktubers. So yes. And there's obviously more booktubers I watch. I just can't sit here for 10 years and talk about everything. But thank you guys so much for watching. If you're new here, be sure to just click the subscribe button and be sure to click the notification bell to be updated for when I post new videos and all that sort of stuff. And I'll see you all very soon with a new video. Bye. Whatever you do in life will be insignificant. But it's very important that you do it.